What's up, my favorite people, my shining stars? I hope you're shining bright, not letting anybody dim that light. My name is Trinity, and welcome to my channel, All About the Healing. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you to my ride and dies that's been rocking with me from the beginning of my time. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys for all your love, your support. Thank you for all your encouraging word, your positive energy. Thank you for rocking with me to the end of time, to this present time. Thank you, guys. For my new, my new subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome. I'm honored. Welcome to the family. All right. From those of you that always want to know what's up with the channel, ring that bell, ring that bell. Donations, energy exchange. For those who have, thank you. For those who that will, thank you. And for those that want to in the future, thank you. Uh, always remember that what you sow into this channel, you shall reap ten times fold. All right. It shall come back to you. All right. This is good ground. Um, it is so, so be it. Ashe. All right. So um, just want to say quickly, not going to go into a spill here, but quickly, I want to say, I'm not, not, not doing personal readings. I have not been doing personal readings. So, uh, they saying a whole lot of people are getting scammed. Don't get scammed by me. <laughs> I'm not doing personal readings. So if anybody contact you saying they need, it's not, it's not. Okay. I'm not doing personal readings. All right. So here we go. Um, we're going to go ahead and get the roll on. All right. So. We are honoring the sign of Leo. Bam! Keep it moving, Leo. Strong, brave, courageous. Keep it moving. Block your haters. Uh, 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 you know what you need to do. All this fire and desire. Block them. Don't let them stop it. Okay? Bam. There it is. All right. So, reason I'm hurrying up, because I want to have plenty of time to... Um, and I don't want the time to run out. So what we're doing is futuristic events happening to you in love very soon. All right. But I'm going to go ahead and break it down for past, present, and future. Why not? Okay. And let's see if they want to say something as well. All right. If they want to say something to you, um, if I feel like it or if I have time, we'll explore that as well. All right. So, um... Um, 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 I think, yeah. Okay, so the pre the past energy here is golden mirror. Okay, so golden mirror, self-absorbed, narcissist, one-sided relationship, love bombing. Okay, um, so in the past, either you, Leo, or your person has experienced a narcissist. Either you, Leo, is, uh, um, is displaying this narcissist, narcissistic um, energy or your person is. But this card is saying somebody is self-absorbed narcissist. This relationship was one-sided. Because we're talking about a connection between a Leo and another person. So somebody within this dynamic was a narcissist or it could be or it could also mean that someone in this dynamic have, have experienced a narcissist. All right, in the past. This is past energy, okay? Um, but we are saying that uh, it was a one-sided relationship. Somebody didn't treat it some did some did not treat someone right. Someone um was giving more than the other person, loved somebody, loved somebody more than the, the other person did. Somebody something about the dynamic in the past with this connection was unbalanced, okay, in some type of way, okay. All right, so the present energy, let's move on. The present energy as it stands right now is enlightenment. Okay, so what I'm getting off of this energy is that um, I don't know who it is, and I'm not going to say it's you, Leo, or it's the person fitting in where it get in because I hate that. Um, when somebody explained it and it's the other person. So I'm going to keep it neutral, but somebody in this dynamic, um, has surrendered 
um, is getting is getting downloads, is being enlightened by the divine. Someone has uh, in this dynamic is has tapped into spirituality, has transformed because see how this person is so opened up and surrendering. This is the divine, someone of wisdom, someone um, that this person is looking onto, is getting guidance from. Here's the sun. So um, this is this is divinely um, energy, okay? And so someone in the dynamic transformed and evolved and ascended to a um, better version of themselves, and they have been enlightened. And um, because of this enlightenment, this person has um, grown, has grown. And it's evolved and has glowed up and um, look good, smell good, is uh, full of wisdom, full of clarity, full of truth, full of abundance, very successful. Um, because they have fully, fully transformed mind, body, soul, and spirit because they have tapped into a version of themselves that they truly... Um, a version of themselves that um, transcends what people, places, and things would would determine that they would ever be. No one never thought that this person would transform into who they are right now. Um, a lot of people are shocked in awe trying to figure them, this person out. Um, but someone in this dynamic, this is someone is being enlightened. Now, I... Um, it, this person is in a position of surrendering to the divine, to 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 what it is that um, the clarity that they are getting from the divine. Okay, at the present moment, that's what's going on with you, Leo, or with your person. They, this person has left people, places, and things. That no longer serve them and have surrendered and evolved into spirituality. A higher version of themselves is what I'm getting out of this. And this person is not the same person. They have removed themselves from this narcissist energy. One-sided relationship. They has This person has turned their back on this energy and has, has surrendered totally to the divine and absorbed and, and um and uh really love and turn their attention and time into themselves loving themselves and becoming a better versions of themselves that's what i'm getting now you can fit it in and get it in where it go but that's what i'm getting from this if you want to know what this person is doing that's what they're doing do you want to know why they're doing this the reason why this person did this is because this person was really hurt this person was hurt from this, this one-sided relationship. This narcissist really hurt this person. And so this person, what this person did is turn their back on that energy and, and start to love themselves. And when they started loving themselves, then they got closer to the divine and start connecting to the divine. The divine started leading, guiding, and directing this person to an ultimate um, spiritual awakening is what happened with this is why this person did this okay let's get on to futuristic because I could keep going on and on and on about that um futuristic okay events that's getting ready to happen in love okay real soon okay first of all Somebody in this dynamic, we already know it's evolved and it's another person is not, okay? The person who is not, who, the, okay, I'm going to say the narcissist, or it could be a, the, person on, that was, the person that's self-absorbed, 
we'll say that because everybody's not a narcissist and that's that that and take that for what it's worth everybody wasn't involved with a narcissist and everybody is not a narcissist it just, it just could have been a one-sided relationship or somebody that was self-absorbed didn't understand that they really loved this person but didn't know how to love this person didn't understand um how they felt at the time sometimes that happens you don't know how you feel about someone until they're actually gone until that energy has uh you no longer getting that energy you no longer that person is no longer in your life that person is missing when that person's energy is missing you start to miss and you start to notice who that person was your eyes start to open up to realize hey i really do care about this person I miss them. I want them back. I, I miss them. I really do care about them. I didn't understand. I didn't know. And a lot of that is what's going on with the collective right now because a lot of people are evolving and moving on. When someone is evolving, they don't look at life the same. They don't see things the same. And they're no longer going to think, feel, or see the way they used to. So they can't really um, go back to that person because they they don't see them the same because they don't they're not the same person anymore anymore so anyway futuristic thing is feeling tied down or frustrated okay so this person that's self-absorbed is really feeling they're really frustrated right now because they're not understanding how this person one minute was all into them was loving them bombarding them with all of this energy wanting them um and now all of a sudden this person is evolved this person is is um have glowed up look happy is happy is at peace um more happy with with the way they in the present than they was with them and this person is frustrated about that because they're feeling tied down they're feeling tied down because they um know their spirit their their soul knows that this person has evolved that that they will they they are at a different level than them and that they can't reach that person where they are so they're feeling tied down they're feeling low vibrational because they feeling like this person have really transformed and they can't really get to this person they really can't connect to them because they this person is really out there you know and i can't I see them, uh, they look somewhat the same, but their whole continents, what the, their vibe that they're giving off is totally, totally different. And it's just really confusing. Um, and then, um, so someone, you know, is undependable and insecure. I mean, insincere. So it could be insecure too, but it says insincere. Um, so, this person here that's self-absorbed feel like that this person is insincere, is undependable because they feel like this person has left them, has abandoned them and moved on and, and did all of these transformations and everything and left them. But I never understood that dynamic. I never understood how people could feel that way because everybody has, everybody has a, a, a purpose. Everybody has a destiny and everybody has a choice. So if you, why would you feel like this person abandoned you and left you when you could do the same thing? You could transform, you can, you can surrender and you can evolve. All you got to do is face your fears and face your face, face your fears Face those issues that you don't want to address. Go ahead and face them once and for all. Some people say that's easier said than done. No, it's not. Everybody has fears. Everybody have things that they have to face. That no, nobody wants to be in pain. Nobody wants to face their issues. But you do it because you know in the long run that you're going to be better off for it. So... Some people realize that and some people just, it's too hard. No, it's not too hard. You take it one day at a time, but you be determined. Just like you determined to hurt other people or you determined to uh, uh, one up or compete or do things to people or or just like you determined 
to 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 uh, hate on somebody you could be determined to take that energy and look within yourself and work out your own salvation work out your own issues when you you can you have a choice just like this person did this person is not insincere, insincere, uh, insincere, uh, sincere. They're not uh, undependable. They're not. This person made a choice to come out of pain and suffering, dealing with a uh, dealing with a one sided relationship, and turn that attention into themselves. That's that was a choice. Everybody has a choice. So this part, that's not that's an error. But that's what is coming out. This person here feels like this person abandoned them, left them, transformed, moved on, and left them. But that's not the truth. You have the same choices that this person has. You can make your choice. You can evolve. You can surrender. You can move forward with your life and go through your purpose and your destiny, just like this person did. And I guarantee you, if you do, Bam, there it is. Your, your eyes will open up. You'll be able to see things different. You'll be able to see things clearly. You'll be able to move forward just like this person did. I'm not promising that you're going to move forward with this person, but you'll be able to move forward. And the person that's meant for you, you will bind with that person. All right, so moving on. Okay, so this person right here, okay, um, it's going to meet a stranger. It's going to meet some, but this stranger is going to be very significant to this person. This card is not telling me if it's love. It's not telling me if it's a business deal. It's just saying a handshake. A handshake could be in business. A handshake can be, um, a friendship or, um, uh, a friendship that turns into something more meaningful. It could mean all kinds of things. Let's look. It says stepping into a new experience. So this person is going to meet with someone. It's going to be very significant. And it's going to um, move into a new uh, experience. Something that this person has never um, has never experienced. It's a new experience. Um, I don't know if it's business or love. Okay. Oh, here it is. It's love. So this person is headed to a new relationship. They're getting ready to meet someone significant. It's going to be a new experience because this person has always been into these low vibrational relationships, karmics and stuff. And so now that this person evolved, this person is ready to experience what a real soulmate is, what real love is, true love. And the vine is going to, is getting this ready, getting this person ready for um, union. So... If this you, Leo, you getting ready to meet somebody new. Your futuristic event is about to be, because it's got it right here, romance and celebration. And you're going to party. You're going to party, party, party. Because this one right here took a long, it took years for you to get this type of love. And a lot of things that you had to go through to get this type of love. And you're going to celebrate it, cherish it. And you're not going to let anyone come between you and this person. So I don't know if this Leo, if this is you, or this is uh, the cross watcher. But somebody getting ready to get into a significant relationship. And le they're leaving behind this uh, self-absorbed self person, their energy. They're leaving that behind. They're turning their back on that. And they're um, honoring, they're opening their heart and honoring a new relationship. Okay. Um, what do we have here? Let's get it. Uh, I see we got... Um, we got the wine glass here. That's somebody's gonna wine and die. Here's transformation. We got the butterfly here. We got transformation. Um, we have the crab here, so it could be a cancer. Um, somebody's heart. Um, did somebody got a hole in their heart? Uh, the self-absorbed person has a hole in their heart, but they want. But you, they feel like that you, whoever this up, uh, this person that's enlightened, they feel like the enlightened person can fill their heart back up. Um, somebody is getting ready to um, have money, wealth, wealth and abundance is coming through this um, soulmate relationship. Um, someone is going to be wealthy or they're going to build wealth. Um, here is, uh, hold on, let me, 
Music is significant. We got a sax saxophone here. Here's the soulmate relationship. Two hearts intertwined together. All right. Um, okay. We got a candy cane. So that's December. That's Christmas. Uh, Sagittarius energy. Okay. Um, or uh, Capricorn. Sagittarius or Capricorn. All right. So we got a heart here that's broken. Somebody's heart broken. This this uh, self-absorbed self person. Heart is broken. Here's the star. We got Aquarius energy here. Okay. Um, spirituality. Okay. We have grace. Somebody wants forgiveness. Somebody wants um, to, to the other person to believe in the relationship. We have the psychic hand right here. Somebody is a psychic. All right. Or somebody has gone to a psychic. Um, someone is suffering in silence with that cross. Here's a key for an opportunity. Okay. We got two keys. Let me see what we got. How many more keys we got? Okay. So we got two keys we're working with. All right. We got two things of um, grapes here, which is abundance. So there it is. So we got two keys of opportunity for money that's coming in. All right. We have leaves. Uh, uh, we got the rainbow, a promise. So the divine has promised. The promises that the divine has um, shared with this person is getting ready to manifest. All right. Here's transformation again. Okay. Here's wine. Okay. Somebody want to wine and dine you. Here's the fish. Here's wealth. Not only would it, is money coming in, but this person is getting ready, is, is going to be able ge to generate wealth. Okay. All right. So we got something about um, uh, the unicorn and this uh, Pegasus here. This That reminds me of uh, fantasy my um, uh, mysticism. Um, okay. Australia. Okay. So we got P X G E A K B Y Y B A. I don't have time. B A. Somebody want to bake somebody something? Yeah, because this is bake. Bakery. Somebody work at a bakery. All right. Okay. So. Your um, your advice card, or what spirit wants to let you know, if somebody is compete trying to compete with you, if this is you, Leo, or whoever is whomever this is that's on here, somebody's trying to compete with you. Um, it says some courage and self confidence. Someone is trying to compete with you, and the, your advice that's coming from spirit is um, to stay in uh, to be confident, to be confident. In whatever you do no matter what this is this is nothing but haters this is nothing but people who want to one-up you want to um, try to um, compete with you to try to win but you've already won you've already won so spirit is saying only thing you need to do is stay confident because you've already won the battle you when you evolved and you and you pour self love in your into yourself and evolve to a higher version of yourself. You won the battle, but these people don't understand that. So let them compete with themselves. You stay confident. You stay true to the divine and let the divine lead and guide your path. Continue on your journey. Don't let these people, places, and things try to deter you. Don't you've already won. They don't know it yet because they, they, they low, they're, they're thinking from a lower perspective, from a higher perspective. This person is seeing things from a different perspective. They're moving and shaking and getting the um, secret knowledge that these people are not getting. But if you, if you start to believe and you start to compete and you start to listen to what or uh, to start to let uh, those projections come in, it could make you, um, uh, delay you. It could put delays and blocks and different things in. But the divine has said, your key is confidence. Stay confident. All right? 
So Leo, that has been your reading. I hope I gave you some clarity. Oh, what this person, do this person have something to say? Hmm. This person want to tell you how much they miss you. They miss you so much. They want you back. But they want the old you back. They don't understand this new person. They don't know who this new person is. They can't connect with this new person. Even though when they look at you, you're so beautiful. You have a light. You have a shine. You have a glow. And it's very alluring. And you're very beautiful. But at the same time, they can't connect with that person. They can't, can't, they can't connect with the new you. They don't know this person. And I just want to tell you that they miss you very much. And that you're very beautiful. That's what they want to say, Leo. All right, so Leo, this has been your reading. All right. Um, if it, it has some kind of clarity for you, uh, you know, you got something out of it, hit the comments and let me know. For those of you that, um, you know, it, you just want to acknowledge or you just want to say, just leave me a heart. Leave a heart in the comments that'll let me know, hey, y'all rocking with me. All right. So like, please like, it helps the channel. Dislike, it helps the channel. Share, share, share. Subscribe. All right. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. I'm going to get back on that. My sister be busy. All right. So I'm going to get back on it. But I want you need to click on there. So when I do, you'll be able to be aware. All right. So your life matters. Black lives matter. All lives matters. Okay. I'm sending you love. I'm sending healing your way. And Trinity is